Hi guys, welcome to today's video. If you're into pattern drafting, you must have heard of Simli 2D and Valentina CAD pattern drafting softwares. Basically, those are the completely free CAD pattern drafting software that a beginner can actually use. Sometimes it can be confusing. Should you use CAD? Should you use Simli 2D or should you use Valentina? Is there really any difference between the two? Because most times, if you see the few videos that are uploaded using Valentina, they always tell you that you can use Simli 2D. And then for a few things that they do with the Valentina, they will now tell you, okay, this might not be present in Simli 2D. So in this video, I'm going to try to see and talk about the differences between Simli 2D and Valentina. I actually use Simli 2D extensively. So I know much more about Simli 2D than Valentina. But I'm going to try my best to see, to let you know what each of them can actually do practically for you to know which to use at the end of this video. So the very first thing we want to do is let's look at their interface. Is there any difference when you first open each of them? What exactly is the difference? That is when you've downloaded the Simli 2D and you've downloaded Valentina. What is the difference between the two? Let's look at their interface. This is Simli 2D, as you can see here. And if you look at it here, these are where you have all your pattern drafting tools. You have your point tools, you have your line tools, you have your curve tools, your arc tools, operations tools. This where you actually create your patterns. You have four different tools here. And you have images. You can add your images to your patterns. I have a playlist of over 15 videos taking you through how to download Simli 2D and how to use it to create all kinds of patterns. The playlist link is below this video. So if you're interested in transiting from manual pattern drafting to digital pattern drafting, you can go through that playlist. So now let's look at Valentina's interface. Can you see any difference? Can you see any difference? I have not seen any difference. So the only thing is that this one has arcs and this has elliptical arcs. But in case of uh, Simply 2D, all the arcs are in one place. <clears throat> operations tools. There's nothing there. It's the same six operations tools. Here, I don't see anything except this particular one. Place label tools. Insert the, the uh, Simli 2D has insert node tools. Then layout. The layout is here, but on Simli 2D, let's look at it again. The layout is up here. This is where you see your layout. So essentially, I don't see any big difference between the layout of Simli 2D and the layout of Valentino. So stay tuned as I continue to compare Simli 2D and Valentina CAD pattern drafting software. Sorry, it's not Valentino, it's Valentina CAD pattern drafting software. So let's now look at the pattern drafting tools when it comes to Simli 2D and the Valentino open source CAD pattern drafting software. If we go to Valentina, you cannot use Valentina without loading measurements. But the difference I've seen between measurements 
loading of measurements and the similitude is that with Valentina, it is called open tape. Like if you click on that measurement, you go to open tape. It opens up a software where you can actually load your measurements. The interface is still the same with Simly 2D. If you go to Simly 2D and you go to measurements, it's called Simly Me. But every other thing is the same. If you open Simly Me, it also opens up this interface. If you look at the interface, it's virtually the same. You have new open template, open individual, open multi-size, and all that. If you also go there to tape, you also have new open individual, and all that, add custom, add new. So essentially, the software that you use to enter your measurements on Valentina and on Simly 2D, has the same interface, just that the names are different. And the kind of um, document type is different. Like for Valentino is .vit kind of document. And if you look at simply to me, I think it's different. It's not .vit, I think it's .vat kind of document when it comes to uh, the measurement types of software you have in the different softwares. And again, Simly 2D is known for being more precise and stable, especially when it comes to using the Simly 2D formulas. If you don't know what Simly 2D formulas are, please watch my playlist. you see what I mean by Simly 2D formulas, you know? And it's quite great, especially if you're, you know, creating pattern blocks and pattern library that you want to use to generate other pattern styles. Valentina is also flexible, but it's a little more technical. Simply 2D for me is, is better for a beginner. Valentina is also good for a beginner, but I think you can do more advanced things in Valentina, especially when you start using it to draft patterns from the few videos I've seen online, you know? So if you want to use Simly 2D, it is fantastic for consistent production style pattern making, while Valentina is great for more artistic and advanced drafting workflows. So let's go to the new thing. I think I just finished with this. This is what I was talking about. Simly 2D files is .vit files and .vst files for standard multi-size and the .vit for individual um, measurement sets. But Valentina files are .val files, file types. They look similar as I've just shown you, but they are not compatible with each other. That means you cannot use one and then import it into the other one and use it. That's it. You cannot switch your patterns back and forth between Valentina and Simply 2D because the file types, when it comes to the measurement sets, are different. So that means if you're working with Valentina, work with Valentina from beginning to end. If you're working with Simly 2D, work with Simly 2D from beginning to end. So let's come now to updates and community support. If we go to, um, let's see, Simly 2D. This is Simly 2D website. You see that they have a forum and community support. If you click on the forum, if I click on the forum, it takes me here. It takes me here because I'm already registered with the forum. If you download Simly 2D for the first time, you will be directed to register or sign up for the forum. Now, this forum has helped me a lot, a lot. <laughs> Because there are different sections. If you have problems when you're creating your patterns on Simply 2D, you will see a lot of you know problems that other people have come across and how they have solved it. And it will help you also to be able to solve whatever problem you come across during your use of Simly 2D. There's a lot here, categories. If you click on any of these categories, like let's say you click, click on patterns, 
You see all kinds of things that people have used, how to true front and back pattern pieces with each other, discussion about new simile pattern drafting system, you know, a lot of things. If you click on it, you see questions people ask and the answers that people give, how to modify a sloper, a lot, a lot of things. So whatever it is, you go to simply me when it comes to how to put in your measurements, you see a lot of things. You know, that is for Simli 2D. Let's go to Valentina. Valentina, on the other hand, I am not aware that they have a community. Instead, they have a blog where you can read a lot about a lot of things you may want. And then number two, when it comes to their um, manual, you know, their quick guide on how to use Valentina, you need to buy it. It's twenty four dollars. It's not free. Unlike Simli Two D, you can get that manual. If you go through the, uh, if you go through the community, you will get the manual. You know to be able to, to use it, to understand. Like here, if you come here, if you come here to manual, see it here. If you come to manual, you get the manual. This is the manual. You don't need to pay for it. Tells you about everything that has to do with Simli 2D. All this. I have gone through all this. This is what I used to learn how to use Simli 2D. And you have it in English, French, German, Italian, and Spanish. But when it comes to Valentina, you have a quick guide in English, which is $24. It's not free. You know? It's not free. And even the video tutorial is not in English, it's in Russian language when it comes to Valentina. Another difference between Valentina and Simli 2D is that right now, with Simli 2D, let's go back to the main website. Right now, with Simli 2D, you can connect it to um what do they call it? you can connect it to this 3d look.ai this is a body scan that can give you your measurements i have a video where i talked about different kinds of body scans that can scan your body and give you basic measurements you can use to draft your patterns right now if you're registered with 3d look.ai which is a software for body scan you can now scan yourself and then connect that scanned result directly with Simli 2D. It's still in better form, but it's good to know that such a thing exists that you might not need to have to be doing your measurements one by one. You know, you can actually scan and connect it to Simli 2D, you know, interface. And if you want to learn more, if you click here, on the Simli 2D software, it shows you and tells you how you can do that. This is it. It shows you how you can do that step by step. So that is another major difference. I don't think uh, Valentina has such a thing as that now. Maybe tomorrow or sometime in the future, they might want to have such a thing. So let's now go to file exporting and printing. With both Simli 2D and Valentina, you can export your patterns as PDFs, you can export them as SVGs, you can export them as PNGs. That means you can print your patterns at home, you can print it as A4 or US letter paper, or you save them for plotter printing. But with Simli 2D, it has a slight edge over Valentina in terms of your layout control. You can, you can organize your pattern pieces in a printable layout a bit more smoothly, you know? Valentina can also do that, but I don't know how smooth it is. As I said, I am not so familiar with Valentina because I am much more familiar with uh, Simply 2D. But from the videos I've watched, uh, Valentina, can also export, you can also, you know, control your layout, the way you want your patterns to lay before you export them. 
but I just feel that with uh, Simli 2D is a little bit more easier, you know, when you get the knack of it. So what then is the verdict? Which should you use? All I can say is that if you're somebody that has been doing pattern drafting manually for some time, and you've also doubled into CAD pattern drafting, and you're more of a creative explorer, and then you have some relative pattern drafting experience, and you want something a little bit more technical, then you can try Valentina. But if you're a beginner, you know, and you're just a simple home sewer, and you have, you have a small business or you run a small fashion business and you want a stable tool that you can really use to make your real patterns, not just for yourself, but for your, you know, little customers that you have, or you just want to create digital patterns to sell. I would say you should go for Simly 2D. As I said, I've used Simly 2D to generate many different kinds of patterns. And the amazing thing is that both of them are free. They are free open source CAD pattern drafting softwares. And both of them can bring your fashion ideas to life without you spending a dime. There's no hidden charges, nothing. So if you're interested in actually learning CAD pattern drafting, you know, transiting from manual pattern drafting to digital pattern drafting, you can check out my playlist on my YouTube channel. This is my YouTube channel. I have a lot of videos here. I have over 400 videos here. And if you scroll down to my playlist, I have a lot of playlists. If I go here to a playlist, um, I have here my Simly 2D playlist where I have over 20 videos, over 20 videos on Simly 2D. And then, Daddy, let me pause this. So as you can see here, Simly 2D free CAD pattern drafting. If you click on any of my videos, you'll see this link, you know, of this uh, Simly 2D playlist. And you can start from beginning because I started from showing you how to download Simly 2D, how to create measurement sets, understanding what measurement sets are, a lot of things. I took you through how to use the tools, how to print out your PDF patterns. In the, I have these Simly 2D basics episodes from episode one, I think, to episode 11 all about Simly 2D, how to use each of those tools, the line tools, the curve tools, the, you know, all kinds of the tools, how to use the layout, everything that you need to know about Simly 2D. And I took you through also how to actually create patterns, different styles using Simly 2D. If that is what interests you, it is completely free. These are things that people actually charge money to do, but I just feel that I want to lay it out there for somebody that is really interested in, you know, growing in their fashion style, growing in their fashion business and taking their fashion business to the digital level. That is it for this video. If you enjoyed the video, remember to subscribe so that when I upload such educative videos, that has to do with CAD pattern drafting, you'll be the very first one to be aware of it. Thank you so much for watching. Hope to see you in my next video.